welcome back. In this video, you're going to learn how to compliment someone. When we talk about complimenting people, we call it paying a compliment. And I'm gonna talk you through my how, what, and why of paying people compliments. So why might we need to pay someone a compliment? Well, let's look at some examples. We might want people to like us more. We might want to build their trust. We might want to take the focus off ourselves, especially if we feel a little bit like we perhaps don't have as much English as the other person that we're speaking to. And we can use it to make a good first impression, especially if we're visiting somebody's home for the first time. And I'll talk to you a little bit about that in a minute. So what are the different things that we could compliment people on? Well, there's three main things. First of all, there's their appearance. So you might compliment them on their hairstyle, or their makeup, or the clothes that they are wearing. Number two, we can compliment them on their skills. So you might compliment them on their cooking, or their ability to create some piece of art or something. Or we might compliment them on their beautiful singing voice, something that they have a particular talent for. And number three, we could compliment them on their possessions. So, for example, if we're in their home for the first time, we could compliment them on their furniture or on their car. So let's have a look at the how. I've created some formulas that you can use to pay somebody a compliment. Here's the first one. What a, or what an, then the adjective, and then the noun phrase. What I mean by adjective is that's how we're gonna describe it. So a word like lovely or beautiful or stunning. And then what I mean by noun phrase is what is the thing that we are going to compliment them on? So let's look at an example for appearance first of all. We could say, what a lovely haircut you've just had. That could be one way of complimenting someone on their appearance. Another way with this formula, but looking at skills, we could say, what a beautiful singing voice you have. And another way, complimenting them on their possessions, we could say, what a beautiful apartment you live in. Let's look at another example of a formula you could use for paying somebody a compliment. So number two, this or that, is a really, now this is our qualifier, so we could actually say very or amazingly, it doesn't have to be really, but in this example it's really, then the adjective, then the noun phrase. So what if we did this for appearance? We could say, that is a really lovely dress you're wearing. And what about if we did it for skills? We could say, this is a really delicious meal you've made. Or what if we did it for possessions? That is a lovely car you have on the drive. So you see how we can start to use these formulas to create our very own compliments, no matter what the situation is. Number three, I really, and remember we can use other words other than really, we might say very, for example. I really like or love and then your noun phrase. So if it's appearance, I really like what you've done with your makeup today. Or if it's skills, I really like the way you dance to the music. Or if it's possessions, I really love your dinner table. And number four, here is another example of a formula you could use, your then the noun phrase, so the thing you're complimenting them on, is or looks, really, and remember with really, you could change it up slightly, and then the adjective, so the describing words. So, if it's appearance, your hair looks really beautiful tonight. If it's skills, your singing voice is really stunning. If it's possessions, your dinner table looks beautiful. So we can actually start to use these formulas for any compliment we want to pay to any person in any situation. But just remember, there are three main things that we're gonna pay somebody a compliment on, and that is their appearance, 
or their skills or their possessions. And remember, it could help people to like you more, trust you more, and it could help you make a really good impression. It's also a great one for striking up a conversation with strangers. So just like in the last video where we talked about making polite small talk, as part of your polite small talk, you could pay somebody a compliment. So next time you are visiting somebody's home for the first time, experiencing somebody's cooking for the first time, or you notice that somebody has a particular talent, or you really like the way that somebody looks, pay them a compliment and let them know, because it's gonna make them feel good, it's gonna make you feel good, and it's a really, really polite thing to do. So thanks very much for watching my video, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye for now.